This video was requested by Tayshawn Cantrell who wrote, I have a ZTZ Max, I need help. Okay, when I put the charger in, it keeps blinking over and over. Is there a way I can fix it, bruh? Today we're gonna learn the name of the problem you're experiencing and how to fix it. This issue is very common and it is known as the red light of death. You still receive your notifications, your phone rings when someone calls you, you still have the attributes of a properly working phone, but your screen is completely blacked out. This happens because the pre-limited binary factors of the device is pushing at intervals which intertwine with one another, causing the capacitor to push more power than it is programmed to. Everything I just said in that sentence is utter bullshit. I just did that to prove my next point. Life lesson number one. Be careful of the people trying to make everything sound so complicated. For example, let's say a doctor who is prescribing you medicine. The one who is honest to God trying to help you will make everything simple and understandable. Whereas the bullshitter that just want to take your money, they're going to be using advanced vocabulary words that only 3% of the world knows. They're up to no good, and on most occasions, that medicine will fix one issue and create another one that's like 20 times worse. Same goes with the technicians. Say you go to a phone place to get a screen repair, and then they open up your phone and say, the conductive wiring and the ABC chip gotta be replaced by the 123 LMNOP. What the fuck? If they're using complicated sentences like that to make you feel stupid, then they're only trying to grab your wallet and slip out $100 bills. The people who keep things simple and make sure you really understand what they're trying to say are the ones who really do want to help you. They're genuine. Let's get back on topic. So the first thing you want to do is completely power out the device. You know the phone is off completely when the LED indicator stops blinking. <laughs> now simultaneously hold the volume up and power button. The moment the phone vibrates, let go of the power button while still holding the volume up. If your phone powers on, then great. I want you to do this next step to make sure that the problem does not occur again for a long time in the future. If you follow my step accordingly, then you should end up on this screen with this green Android guy. Use the volume buttons to navigate through this menu. Click the volume down button until you reach white partition catch. Press the power button to click it. At the bottom of the screen in yellow text, it'll say wiping catch, formatting catch. Then once again, hold the power and volume up key simultaneously. Once you feel it vibrate this time, let go of both buttons. Let me know in the comments below how it worked out for you. If this method didn't work, there's a likely chance that you or someone else dropped this phone. Go into a well-lit environment and examine the LCD panel located under the glass screen to see if there are any hairline cracks. And that should be it, Tayshawn. If this video helped you in any ways, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Questions or suggestions for any future videos, leave them in the comments below. If you would like to see any more videos like this from me, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you soon. Anyways, guys, it's been GD here from Get Fixed, and I'm out. New year, new breeze. Same grass, old trees. Do something to help somebody. Peace.